We're not getting married in Italy. We had to take this tough decision a few months ago. Tell me that you're married with an Indian without telling me that you're married with an Indian. I'll go first. And why Pizza Hut for us is just like a big no-no. With Mickey Mouse! <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> <laughs> what up, everybody? It's Ray here. Hey, everyone. Julia here. We are laughing because today we're just talking on top of each other the entire day. No, it's not, it's not synchronized, but that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, today we are actually vlogging after a long time. We're gonna take you around with us. We have a lot of things to do today, so make sure you stay around. There is also a really important piece of information that we need to share with you which is why we have used that title, but we're gonna tell you more later. That's it, after breakfast, it's time to start. Come, follow us. today we're gonna shop for we're clothes. gonna shop until you draw give me the it's credit card <laughs> lifestyle, guys. we don't have enough clothes now no that's not true actually we are doing some shopping with the finances because we're going on holiday that's cool, that's cool. and we need some stuff and we honestly didn't shop for months and months it feels a bit weird to shop again but this is an open-air mall and between the two guess who is more excited about the mall because <laughs> there's a really think... nice place here that does Oreo shakes. I'm so looking forward yeah, to it. Yeah, so whenever you want to get Shrey out the house, you just need to motivate him with some sort of food stuff. So today it's Oreo shake. And maybe some pizza. No. Few moments later. I'm at the Pizza Hut. I'm at the Taco Bell. I'm at the combination Pizza Hut and Taco Bell. Are you happy with your food? I'm really happy with the pizza, but. But. I have to say, like, Indian food is my favorite food, followed by Italian though. Oh my god, that's like a love declaration. You might be wondering how am I allowing him to eat Pizza Hut in front of me because I'm Italian and in Italy Pizza Hut is definitely not a thing. We might be able to show you what a real pizza is in Italy pretty soon after this video. So maybe you're gonna understand why Pizza Hut for us is just like a big no-no. But then, you know, like when I started living abroad, I started understanding that getting real pizza was quite difficult and quite expensive back then. Now it's easier. So I also started eating Pizza Hut. Don't tell my Italian friends though. So, um, been a few hours in. <laughs> yes. Our shopping is still going on. Let us show you what we got. It's a full time business, guys. Shops. <laughs> It is. So we basically got all colorful stuff. These are my t-shirts, lots of colors. I can't show you. Most of pastel color, because those are my favorite. This is Shay Kusher with Mickey Mouse. <laughs> he was like, are you sure people won't laugh at me? I'm sure. These are like other shirts that he got. Oh my God, I need to show you this. I love this. I was like, oh my God, this is amazing for going around when I travel and then I asked the guy like oh which collection is this it's the kids collection that's me I'm a kid at heart oh. all right it's now time to explain the reasoning behind the title that we have put today do you want to start we're not getting married in Italy no that's not this true. year this year this year yes we had to take this tough decision a few months ago I think when the second wave was hitting India, we realized that it would have been insensitive to ask people to come from India to Europe. And also we were a bit unsure whether that would have been possible even for September. We were planning to get married in September this year. And so we had to take a tough call. And I think we took it when we flew to Italy, right? In May. Exactly. The whole reason we want to do a celebration is so that we can have our friends and family all yeah. in one place. And then if it's only like if my my family from India and my friends from India cannot come, yeah. then it's not a joyful celebration. So we would rather wait 
one more year and do it well. We have to do it like uh, they have to do it soon, but not properly. So we want to do it properly. Yeah, and Italy regulated the weddings and the, all the celebrations just a few months ago, and there are a lot of rules that. I definitely understand and we definitely understand but they will basically stop us from living the time and living the moment and living the celebrations like we want to so yeah we had to take the tough call this is the second time we are postponing the marriage right yeah. so <laughs> hopefully next year if there's no other variant yes but we will keep postponing until it's possible from for everybody from India yeah. and Europe to meet and if, even if that means we have to do our marriage like five years later so be it yeah this is gonna be the time where our families will meet you know so for us it's really important that's true like my parents and Julia's parents have not met no they have spoken on the phone and everything but they have not met and this is gonna be the first time for Shrey's family to visit Italy we want to take them around our friends in India they can't wait to see Italy and Europe and this is gonna be the time for them to actually plan their trips around Europe so we feel a bit like their responsibility to make sure that it happens around the right time. Now, the new date, we can't say it, but it's going to be spring 2022, right? Is yes. it spring or already summer? No, it's spring. It's all, yeah, it's spring. In India, it would be summer. In Europe, it's spring. <laughs> We, we luckily have amazing suppliers and we are working for, with great vendors and they 100% understood the situation. So how it works in Italy is that you prepay, you give them a sum to block the date. And given the COVID situation, you are, they are okay in moving the dates. So this is the second time we're moving the dates with the location, uh, with the photographer and the videographer, with the catering that you have seen in the previous videos. And yeah. Hopefully it's sad. It's like we would have want, we would have loved, loved to have it like already this year. Yeah. If it was September, imagine it would be next next month. My like. God. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, that so would be like crazy. it's going to be fantastic for sure. Yeah, we can't I wait, hope. and we really want people to feel comfortable and to be able to fly and to get the visas and get all of these things sorted. So, yeah, pray for us that it's gonna happen in spring next year. All right, that's it for the break. We go back and shop more. Mishra is dead. I'm dead, guys. <laughs> Shopping is a full-time job. Tell me that you're married with an Indian without telling me that you're married with an Indian. I'll go first. This is our dinner at the mall. This is my dinner. Dun, 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 dun. This is his dinner. Wonderful life. <laughs> I actually love Chole too. So I might have to steal it from you. All right. That was it. Time to end the video. Yes. And also the mall is now closed. <laughs> we closed the mall, guys. We have no choice <laughs> but to go out. We could have shopped all night as well. Yeah, we had a long shopping date. It was really overdue, right? Yes. Anyway, we hope you liked the video. As always, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye. By the way. If you like these types of videos, like more like vlog types, let us know in the comments below because we are testing it out, right? Yes. So we would like to know if you like this kind of formats more so that we basically take you around what we do as much as possible during the weekend because during the week we work. Um, but yeah, let us, let us know if you like these type of videos below. Bye-bye.